Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of uh, Space Engineers Solo Let's Play with your forgetful host, Ananus from Ananus Gaming. I keep forgetting to check that timer. So you guys, are I just get cut off like, whoa, I just get cut off in the middle of a sentence or whatever. It's pretty funny. So these lights, the last four lights are the airlock lights. So let's modify these. Airlock interior lights. Save that as a group and let's make them blue. I don't know. Make them like purple. If we can. Anyways, uh, radius should be high. And. Did I just say that again? No. Okay. So. Ooh, this is bright. But it totally looks like UV, right? Nice. Oh! Just got a new mail. Phone's on vibrate. All right, so if we come out here, we're gonna have our regular lights right there, leading in. And still debating about other types of light out here. So we'll deal with that later. I just, I don't know what to put there yet. So let's see. I think I want to have lights coming all the way back here. And then uh, a strip going over there. Not just to provide lighting, but you know, I think I want to have some coming in here and then pointing straight out there. But that's a 4x4, four four, isn't it? It's not going to line up. Ooh. So what we'll do here is if we can get ourselves oriented, oriented right, uh, we'll put one there one there, one there, Oops. stupid keys, one there, I think that'll do. That doesn't look too bad. That doesn't look too bad. And then, um, maybe put ones above. And that was like, the pattern was like this. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to color this hanger, the lights in this hanger differently. As well as the doors. I know, I need energy. <laughs> so let's uh, check this out. So let's say, let's call it something different. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight. And we'll call this uh, small hanger and lights. Save that, and then I think what we'll do is we'll color them red, turn up the radius, 
and then close that. That's the red hanger. We need to get energy. That'll be cool. And I think what we'll do is we'll color the hangar doors red. Oxygen low. Oxygen high. Okay. For a second there, I thought it was... Uh, <laughs> All right. Now, when we finally get all this, get this all worked out and the hangar all done, it's gonna be great because uh, I could color those red too. It's gonna be great because then we'll be able to start building small ships and bringing them in and such. Now, we are gonna want hangar doors on this, and this is only one wide, so it's gonna be they're gonna be obvious, and they're gonna have to go up and down. That's four, right? Whoops. One, two. One, two, three, four. Okay. So we're going to end up cutting this out and cutting that top one out and putting hangar doors, airtight hangar doors in there. Now, this one is going to be different. We're definitely going to have to cut the sides out of this one. Um, so they're going to be showing on the outside. I think we're going to have to cut out all four sides. But we'll see. We'll see. So I think this is going to be green hanger. I think that's going to be the green hanger. I don't know. Um, maybe this will be the green area. This this area will be green, and then this one will be blue. Not quite sure yet, but. This is cool. I like the color in here. It's very uh, UV-ish, or uh, you know what I mean. Looks sanitary. It's pretty cool. So we'll need a control panel for in there. So I'm thinking we're gonna put a light here and put a light here. Put a light out there, put a light on either side, you know what I mean? And have a red one and a green one. And what it'll do is it'll let you know if it's pressurized. And then we'll put in a, we'll put in an, an air vent in there to seal that off and put an air vent in there. And then we'll have a con button control inside, outside, and inside. Or excuse me, inside and then uh, one in there and then one out here. That's pretty cool. It's hard to see in there, but the lighting will make it possible. And we need to have a conveyor system. So we're probably going to have our conveyors hook up over here in the green section. <laughs> we'll have to see about that. And uh, this door is, oh, these doors look massive when you're walking around. I think we're doing some pretty good work here. I think this is really cool. Wow, you can really see that light outside. Hmm. Uh, I like it though. I do like it so far. What do you guys think? Throw me a comment or something. Let me know what you think. Let's, let's get farther back and take a look. I think it's starting to look pretty bad. <laughs> pretty bad. All right, so let's go over here and dump off all the stuff that we have inside us right now. And uh, go up. And then uh, we will put an antenna down there because we need an antenna down there. We're, we're not gonna. So, best way, best way to get all the stuff you need for an antenna is grind down an antenna. So, let's grind down an antenna. And we're full. Let's get our antenna ready. Uh, world 
Those things scares me every time. All right, now let's put this over here. Whoops. What did I do? Get the rest of it. I think we I know what we're gonna do with this ship. I think we're gonna turn it into a warship. We're gonna turn it into an attack ship. You know, I still don't see the I I don't see the use of beacons uh, as opposed to antennas, except for the fact that antennas take up more power. But I don't know. Oh, we're short one steel plate? How the heck did that happen? Whatever, it works. Let's throw a steel plate in it later on. I think that's really cool for the first level of our, our little base there. Is there anything else up here that we want to take off to put on there? No, I kind of want to leave the turret on there because we're going to use that later on. Oh, we definitely want to take this off because it causes lag. I don't like those things at all. And I think they cause lag even if they're not on. And my frame rate just jumped up five frames per second. Yeah, they cause lag even if they're not on. That's something good to know. <laughs> All right. I like the interior of that. I kind of want to throw up the rest of them now. Let's see. Construction components, we got plenty. All right, so... And, of course, we have to press the button every time we want to place one. Rotating them every time. It's ridiculous. All right. Is that going to line up perfectly? Nice. Exactly what I wanted. luck. It's on your side. <laughs> Hello. Alright, we're doing good. So this, our asteroid base is coming together. That's a good thing. So now we want to put some over there. Just like that. So one, two, It's not really, it's not really in the middle. I want it in the middle. Whoops. Whoops. Hitting buttons like crazy now. All right. Want it right in the middle. Okay, there we go. It's right there. Alright guys, well this episode again is up. I hope you enjoyed my, our little forte into base building and uh, little by no memes at all actually. Alright, I've been taking this forever. But please like, subscribe, comment. I'd really like to hear from you guys. And tell people about the channel. I'm trying to grow and... Oops, uh, save. 
Okay. And I will see you in the next episode.